Look at what's happening around the D this weekend. There's a lot of stuff going on. Rich Rice, the aforementioned Rich. The founder of the event planning company Detroit by Design is back with us. Thanks for hanging out. How are you doing? Good. So let's check out the outfit. I would expect uh, the shade that he dropped on me a minute ago, trying to make it seem like all I do is fast food. You, you look at the way he's dressed. I, if I was too good for McDonald's last time. Oh I was. Look at the way he's dressed. I had your back. We squashed that. Country right. Club Chad is going to call me out for going to McDonald's. This is, in the, I'm into this it, is my Malto meal uh, breakfast out here. Meal. Oh, now we've got Malto meal <laughs> in the mix. Uh, Quick and Loans Winter Blast weekends are back. Yeah, this is so cool. As an event planner, it's always really challenging to keep the events going through the winter. And uh, John Witt started this one up back in 2005 for the Super Bowl. He mm -hmm. does a fantastic job with it. Quicken Loans has jumped in to, to help support. And uh, there you go, they're doing a zip line for the next one. This one, they're going to have a, a slide that goes 20 miles an hour that's going to um, come down over the park. You can see the warming stations. I think DTE provides those. But that's a, a nice, uh, really cool touch. You can do the marshmallows and the warming stations. And I believe there's um, free ice skating cool. this weekend. It's going to be running from Friday to Sunday. And uh, you may have to pay for your, your rental skate, so it's something you could check out on the website. But the, the whole thing's a free event to kind of act, activate the whole downtown area and give you something fun to do in the cold weather. I hear that word more these days, activate. Activate, that's kind one of, of those buzzwords. It's like amazing. Yeah. It's one of those bur buzzwords that's going to become part amazing. of the Amazing, you mean amazing. Exactly. Participatory, experiential. <laughs> yeah, experiential, <laughs> yeah, exactly. All right, well, people are going to be getting their brunch on this weekend in the D. What's going on? Yeah, shout out to the Zania brothers. They've been kind of uh, making this the, the hip corner of Woodbridge Village in old Detroit before everything was activated. This was this was really kind of the anchor spot. And the Metro Times is, is coming in and kind of honoring that. And and they're going to activate the whole place. And they're really good at bringing in the surrounding community there. And the optics the, of that is great. The optics being another the one. The optics. Right, right, right. But I'm good look. Forgot about that. <laughs> it is good a good look. look. As yeah. at the Majestic Theater, Garden Bowl, and the Magic Stick, right? I've been to Uni this before United We Brunch. Yeah. It's a really fun event. Yeah, it's cool. So this is something that, that uh, newspapers and magazines are good at, is, is bringing kind of these tastes together. So all these people that they're a part of showcasing in the magazine, they kind of bring it to life through this live magazine thing. So you get to taste all the old and, and the new brunch spots in Detroit. Yes. There's a little bit of entertainment with it. It's uh, If you can still get pre-sale tickets, I believe they start at uh, 40 bucks. Those are going to bump up at the door. And then there's a $60 VIP package where you get a little VIP room with some special tastings and a commemorative cup. Got you, got you. All right. Ross and Rachel and all their friends are going to be in the D this weekend? Yeah, City Theater is doing the parody of, of Friends. Has Very it been, funny. how long has it been since Friends was on? Has it been 10 years yet? Has it been 10 years yet? Was it, that was kind of the 90s, right? Is that the, <laughs> yeah, that was, was that over? Definitely that a show. Been more I, than, I, I started watching Friends in reruns. I wasn't like running to the TV to watch it, but this all sounds right. interesting. This is a comical look at the famous show with a little music added in. Tickets are 30 bucks. The shows are tonight, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday okay. at the City yeah. Theater. And there's a special event to help animals out in Royal Oak. We love this. Yeah, this is really nice. I think they're kind of playing with the idea of, of thinking of your four-legged friends for Valentine's Day as well. Mm -hmm. And um, this is at the, being hosted at the Comedy Castle, so you get kind of the full package. You oh. get a little... A little comedy entertainment. Is that an adorable dog there? Um, you get the uh, comedy package, starts at 745, and then there's a dinner involved. The Rainforest Cafe is going to do a special dessert for this one. And uh, all the, the proceeds go to uh, shelters that are providing kind of warming stations uh, through the cold. And it's it's a few days in front of Valentine's Day, so you can still honor your, your two-legged friends for nice. Valentine's Day on the 14th. Well, tickets are just $25 this Sunday at 515. Rich, thank you. Thank you. All right, you can check out what's <laughs> happening around the D by going to the live guide at clickondetroit.com slash live guide. Yeah, that's so cool. Right.